everybody. Welcome back to the Pine Room. Today we are at West Liberty University with the Hilltopper softball team, and today we're gonna try to hit some balls. Emphasis on try. Thank you, Cal Cruz. <laughs> Do you like my chances here? They're pretty slow. I thought so. She's there. God, that's close. Oh, I have Hey, hey I, well, he, a lot of people, a lot of people watching might not realize that. I mean, I, I was a college shortstop, but the problem is, yeah. Hey, find it. The problem we have is that I wasn't a very good hitter anyway. There's no way he even makes contact. Oh yeah, he's done. <laughs> From Carroll, Ohio, attended Burn Union. Oh my God. Ladies, uh, we got a price right? Oh, uh, okay. Too long. Fine. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Was it? What, what, what pitch was that? I'm not telling you. I just wanted to know. That was a change up. No way that was a change up. Hey, fine, fine. It's high. Swing yesterday, Jeff. Okay. Two two. Got to throw a rise ball. You're you're flamethrowing. So right now we have Jared. Oh, I knew I knew the rise ball was coming. Full count. I don't think I've ever taken that pitch in my life. It's, honestly, there's no way that I will ever hit a rise ball. No way. So is it like clearly just going up? Oh, it is. It's like it starts down here and up here. I actually Settle. Settle. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. Stop hey, sit. That. Stop that. What did I say? I said, yeah, he did. Guys, that's down. <laughs> Good luck, pitch. Try to intimidate me. I think it's 
I guessed right. That was not a fastball. That was not a fastball. What was that? Why would I? That's what I know. You're throwing across your body. Oh. Ah, good. Jesus. I can't do that. Welcome into the Pine Room Podcast. So anyway, joining us here on the Pine Room Podcast, to my left or to your right as you're watching this is Riley Conkle. She's a senior from Coshocton, Ohio. She is a corner infielder. And to our sitting on our right or your left is the shortstop from Carroll, Ohio, attended Burn Union High School, Sydney Little. Ladies, uh, thank you for joining us. We appreciate you taking the time and uh, coming on to the Pine Room Podcast. Thanks for having us. <laughs> yes, thank you for having us. Looking forward to this. Well, out so, of these four pitchers that, that we're going to face today, who, who who throws the hardest? I would say probably Sarah. Oh, so you lead us. You lead us, <laughs> our poor guys, off with your, your with your uh, your flamethrower. Got to knock the confidence down a Jeez. little bit. So, Sydney, let me ask you this question: How hard do you think she throws? Um, I'd say probably 63. Okay, so 63. Now compare that to, uh, I know there's a comparison that they make to uh, pitching, uh, a fastball and pitching. Do you know the, the comparison, how it works? Uh, I honestly have no Well, clue. Jarrett was saying he thought it might be up in the, in the 80s. Okay, so so a sixty so a sixty three mile an hour softball fastball is probably comparable to uh, probably mid to high eighties. Would you yeah, say? Yeah, for baseball, yeah. Mid to high eighties. And how far are you guys from the the, the forty three feet? Forty three feet compared to oh, that's only forty three. I thought it was sixty. No, no. Jesus, <laughs> forty three feet. That is on top of you. So how how uh, now you guys? Uh, let's talk a little bit about your season. Now these you we have four freshmen who are probably going to be your pitchers um, this year. Uh, is that correct? Yep, we have four that are probably going to be our main go tos this year. The freshmen. Mm-hmm. So you lost uh, you lost the bulk of your uh, pitching staff, correct? We lost all of our pitching staff. Which wow. was which was probably well I don't want to say the strength but that was our the, pitching was one of the best things yep. we had <laughs> arguably the best aspect for us or the so, asset we had so uh, based on what you saw in the fall and you know now that you're doing individuals here in the winter how how do you are are you guys confident that these girls can handle this uh, this grind of a schedule uh, yeah um, they go at it. They come in here and do their time on their own, get it done, and they'll definitely be fine. It's exciting to watch how the freshmen react compared to we always had the older pitchers. I think they'll be ready. It's going to be a fun season. No. What, Go ahead, Chris. No, what was it like for you guys uh, making the, the, the transition from high school pitching to once you got to college? Was it was it eye, an eye-opener? It opener? was eye-opening for sure. Mm-hmm. I. I would say in high school, I had no no struggles, just like mm-hmm. the competition we saw. I got here, and it it took me back for sure. It yeah. was a knock to my confidence for you a little humbled. bit. You were humbled. Oh, I was humbled <laughs> very <laughs> quickly. I think I think everyone who comes in is very humbled. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You come in thinking you're going to be like this all-star, and then you just yeah. get right. knocked yeah. right Completely back down. Completely different level. Of- you guys have had pretty good success. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. I don't know individually. Uh, I think both of you have been – pretty successful what your team also has been successful mm-hmm. i want to talk a little bit about last year you guys were 35 21 and one uh you you want you lost your opening game to state mm-hmm. uh in the tournament and then you came back and won three elimination games and then uh and then you lost to wesley and two to one and i'm sure a heartbreaker yeah it was tough um i think just going into it after losing that first game we 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 weren't ready to go home, and we weren't going to go home without a fight. And then you you got beat two one by Wesley. Now, when you lost to Wesley, and was that was that uh, did you have to come out and beat them twice? Is that how that worked? So that was yes. the finals, correct? Yes. No, it was. We no. would have had to just beat them to get into the to championship. Into the ship, uh, and then, and be, then we would have had to beat Fairmont twice. Oh, fair. And did Fairmont end up winning it? They did. Now, looking back uh, uh, at the season and and looking forward to this year, do you guys? 
Do you feel confident that you can get back to where you were last year? Mm, for sure. I think our hitting this year is going to be a lot stronger. In the past, we relied a lot on our pitching, and so like our field didn't have to do as much and our hitting didn't have to do as much, whereas this year I think we've improved in those other areas where we lacked in the past. Yes, I, I can agree with that. Um, our main thing right now we are focused on is hitting. Um, that's, our, that's our big thing, and we're only getting better, so that's going to help us a lot. Now, besides your pitching, you lost. Uh, what What else did you? I know you lost Cat. Was Cat? She, she two, got years. two years ago. Yeah. Okay, two years ago. So, who else did you lose from last year's team besides the pitching? Uh, our we, center yeah. fielder, Katie Beeman. Katie Beeman. Okay, that's that's. She was like your number four or five hitter, correct? Yes. Yeah, she was our four hitter. Okay, uh-huh. and then I other think than that, that was it. That was it. Yeah. Okay, was so there were yeah, there were a couple more, but they didn't play as much. So, so you return a good nucleus in the field yes. and hitting. So, mm-hmm. so, I mean, obviously you're counting. Hopefully, hopefully your pitching will come through. But, but you're 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 counting on being able to score some runs. Yep. Do you guys play? Do you play a lot of small ball too? I know in the past you guys in have. In the past we have. I think we're still going to incorporate that. It's paid off for us in the mm-hmm. past. We have a lot of speed. We're able to move the runners and score everyone run re- every run we can. Good luck, pitch. Lost one hundred to make contact. Last strike? No. Foul ball. Foul ball. That was my game plan, make you walk a little bit. Get foul ball! Hey, you're ahead. Good. 
Okay. Well, uh, I got a question. Yep. Uh, you you guys are both uh, you're seniors, so you're you're the leaders. Uh, when you first got here, got here, I mean, you look back, you you say to yourself, where, where did these years go already? Oh, oh. yeah, it's I mean, so fast. Yes. Like I can't believe I'm a senior already. Uh-huh. Like, I blanked. It, I blanked yeah. in. It's incredible. And it's it? only going to get worse the longer you <laughs> get. So I'm just letting you know that because it's. So, now, do you get an extra year for the COVID? Or we this? do get an extra year for COVID okay. still. So, so uh, tell tell us about your future bit outside of softball. I'm sure once softball is over for you guys here, you're probably putting down the glove and and bat and ball and uh, moving on in your life. Uh, uh, Sydney, what's your what are your plans? So I'm a nursing major. Um, I graduate in the spring, so hopefully I pass my boards and I can become a nurse, maybe go to graduate school, become a nurse practitioner. Nice. That's my goals. I'm from, like, Columbus area, so hopefully I can work in one of their hospitals someday. Oh, that's awesome. Riley? So I actually graduate uh, next Saturday with my undergrad in education and special education, and then I'm completely switching the tracks and getting my master's in healthcare management starting in the spring so tell it last thing and then we'll let you guys go what uh how was your because i went to west liberty i played baseball um many many years ago so riley how was your uh, four years you're you're gonna get out for how was your four years here um honestly i don't think i could have experienced anything better um it's so homey everyone knows everyone you walk across campus you you're gonna see someone you know you say hi um the softball team has brought me a lot of great friends, uh, friends that I'll have for a lifetime. So it's honestly just been a great experience. Uh, I love it. Sydney, what, uh, what, what, tell us about your West Liberty experience. How did you enjoy your four years? Yes, four years. Um, I, I love it here. The team environment itself. I came to West Liberty not knowing a single person, and a lot of locals go here, I would say. I didn't mm-hmm. know anyone. I was so scared. I came here, and I've made my best friends that I'll have for the rest of my life. I, I love it. The dirty dog and all. Out of way? I tried to hit that one 400 feet. Good pitch. Good try. Ah. 
so far. Good. Good, Good afternoon. Yeah. Yeah. I got two. All right, now let's talk about these guys. Uh, we have to my to my left or your right, uh, Madison Angus from Weirton, West Virginia, just up the road from us. And to our left, or correction, our right or your left, it's Sarah Simon. And Sarah is from Philippi, West Virginia, and attended Philip Barber High School. Ladies, thank you for joining us. After throw, we're going to talk a little bit about... Um, your outing. Thank you for joining us. Thanks for having us. <laughs> we just got done talking to uh, Sydney Little, who will be uh, your shortstop, and then Riley Conk will be one of the corner infielders. Had uh, wonderful things to say about you guys and uh, the pitching staff. Um, you know, you guys lost. Uh, well, not you guys because you weren't here, but the team lost pretty much all their pitching. So you guys have uh, quite big shoes to fill. Madison, let me let me ask you first. Um, and we we talked earlier. How has the adjustment been from pitching at uh, Weir High to now? Even though you haven't, well, you did. Did you pitch in the fall a little bit in a game? Oh yeah, a little in scrimmages. The adjustment. Let's talk about the the change of talent coming, obviously, from high school to college. Um, it's definitely you have to make sure you're pitching off the plate, make spinning the ball more because high school it's just not everyone's at that level, so it's. Every batter is a good batter in college. That's that's a really really good point. Uh, I'm glad you brought that up. That's a great point. It, in in high school, you pretty much just relied on throwing it down the middle and probably striking most of the batters out. Where now, if you throw it down the middle, it's gone. Yeah. Yeah. You, you're going to have yeah. problems. So have you have uh, when you came here? Did you have uh, several uh, pitches that you you could go to where that you really have to rely on? You know, uh, other than the fastball, something other than the fastball. Yeah, I have my curveball and my screwball that I rely on a lot. Okay, Sarah, let's let's turn to you, Philip Barber. Yeah. Um, down in Philippi, West Virginia, where Alderson brought us is. Mm-hmm. First, can I ask you this? Have you ever been to Little Mo's? Yes, yes. I knew you were going to ask. I knew right away. <laughs> I should have yes. let, let you ask that, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> anytime somebody mentions Philippi, you always ask about well, that's. A, I think that's the only bar there is in Philippi, isn't it, Sarah? Um, to my knowledge, yes. So <laughs> they say the wings there are, are really good. They are. And and well, I I won't ask you what else is good there, but uh, <laughs> but uh, why she's in season now? I, oh, well, not quite in season, but all right. So Sarah, you uh, you also uh, coming in as a freshman, what adjustments have you had to make to to know that you're going to be able to compete at this level? Um, well, I mean, just working on my pitches, make sure that they're like where they need to be. Um, fielding, you you know, you got to be pretty pretty good at that if you want to be a fielder too. But hitting. Hitting, I think hitting is like one of the biggest things, especially um, making good solid contact with the ball, um, making smart decisions in the box. That's, that's what I've really worked on since I've been here. What was a, what was the recruiting process like for you? It, it was pretty tough. So my, but my travel team, we went around to like different colleges. So for instance, okay. we came up here and scrimmaged against them, and um, so that's where I got to know her. And okay. Play against this team. That's that's kind of how the recruiting process went for me. It's hard not to like Herb. Yeah, yeah. Hell of a guy, uh, Madison. Uh, the same same question. How, how did you did you get some look from you know any other uh, colleges? Um, I emailed Fairmont. They emailed me back, but I never went up and met with them. But here, I also scrimmaged. <laughs> and 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 so what what sold you on West Liberty coming here and playing softball? Um, close to home, and I just liked the campus. Sarah, how how have you adjusted to the college life? Do you like it? Do you like it here? Yeah, I like it. It's um, pretty busy for me. Um, I play two sports here. So oh, what else? I play golf actually. Oh, you golf? Yeah, okay. I golf. So um, it took a little. I think it took me around like two and a half weeks to like fully adjust, but I love it. Just always having something to do. Uh, always having something to do in the yeah. fast-paced town of West Liberty. Yes. Well, coming from Philippi, I'm sure it wasn't much of a <laughs> much no. of a change. No, I played I played a lot of sports in high school, so it, 
I'm just kind of used to it. Did you play basketball at? Uh, I, I did. Yeah. Philip I played, Barber. I played soccer, golf, softball, and basketball. Oh my! You kept busy. <laughs> yeah, I was you, very busy. You definitely kept busy. And Madison, did you play any other sports in high school? I played volleyball my freshman year, but that's. And then you then you were strictly a softball yeah. player. Okay. Now, now for both of you, is is, uh, is it too early okay. in your college career? Do you know what what you want to do with your future, or are you just kind of feeling your way around first? Oh. My goal is to overall become an athletic trainer. I just okay. I love what they do, and I want to stay in sports, so that's my goal as of right now. Madison, what about you? Uh, to become a physical therapist is my goal. A little bit of, little bit of cash there if you, <laughs> if you hit it right. Well, All right, now let's talk about these guys that you guys face. These, <laughs> as I say that, Cooley's like Sorry, out on his – he yeah. was like standing on his front foot. <laughs> hey, Cools, what happened there? <laughs> What was that? <laughs> so, what, what did you think of the uh, what did you think of these hitters? They're, they're pretty solid. They surprised me. Yeah. Really? Yeah. You know, they weren't they weren't just uh, they weren't lame ducks like you thought they might be. Yeah. Uh, no comment. <laughs> <laughs> I, I will admit, one got a hit off me. That was I was I put myself in a bad position. So. Oh yeah, you threw it down the middle, didn't you? No, that was an inside pitch, but I had a three zero count, so I had to put it on the plate. Oh, yeah. oh, okay. Or it might have been three one. I don't really remember. But you had to, you had I to bring had to, it. I had to put it somewhere. So, uh, and and we'll cl- we'll close unless Chris has. Uh, are you guys really, really anxious and nervous to you know to take the mound at the at the college level? Um, no, for me personally, I'm excited. I'm ready. I just, I'm ready for it, honestly. And and you, t- I mean, obviously, it's going to be a challenge because I I've seen some of these teams uh, that that we face and they're. They're pretty darn good. So, yeah. uh, but but with that with that confidence and with that uh, that attitude, I think you're going to be. I think you guys will do well. Uh, Madison, are you uh, anxious to get get going? Yeah, I'm. I'm excited to be out on the mound again. It's been a while. Well, that'll be that'll be great. I think you, you guys are going to have to. Uh, uh, have they told you about some of the long? Well, I guess not bus rides, but van rides. Van to, ride, yeah. <laughs> well, and that, that's going to be tough. <laughs> Used Set to. a hot spot up and do your homework. That's what I do. Oh, oh, out of the way! Way to execute! Hey, you can shake me. How do you feel about this? But I'm surprised I can actually swing at it. You're good. It ought to be a mingle. Donde esta su vez, señorita?
just off. Nice job. The odds are the odds are getting better that you're going to make contact. And Slim has left the building. Oh, oh. Two balls, oh. one strike. We're in the bottom <laughs> of the seven. Runner on second. We're we down a run. We're in for the conference championship. The line, the pitch. Ah! I like that too. Two two. This is it. Come the crowd. It's a little wild. Here comes. She rocks. She delivers. Way foul. Way foul. Ball. What do you guys think Ball. that was? What was that? A home run? Yeah, it's an out. Job. What do you think that was? Two two. She looks in. Oh! Right out of his front foot, he pops up. That's an out. The right field. Is that it?